Hey ladies, today I am doing another Sparkly Saturday. This week I've got some exciting things and you know what, I haven't even opened everything yet so I'm really excited to be opening them while I'm recording, that's really cool. Uh, this week on my nails I've got some pinkish red sparkle goodness going on. Let me see if I can zoom in for you guys. Ooh, sparkly. I haven't done any nail art with this, just um, just some pretty polishes. And I layered two, and this is one of my favorite Zoya color colors. It's Zoya, obviously, and it's Riva. And I just layered it with a little bit of Color Club, just pink, sparkly, hollow. Some It's not really hollow, it's more iridescent, but it's pretty. Um, and that's all I have on. I was going to do some other stones and whatnot added on, but... Uh, just didn't get there, you know? It happens. So, yep, that's what's on my nails this week. And uh, let's get to the unboxing part because I am really excited to share this stuff with you because I feel like you guys are interested in this as well. Uh, these are two of my favorite pairs of shoes that I have right now. And these are actually the second pair of these that I've ordered. I have them in black. And then these are, this is gonna be like my sixth pair because I literally love them and I ended up buying them in a couple different shades. It's, it's amazing. Okay, so I got both of these at, at Macy's during their uh, one of their recent sales, but Macy's always has sales, so just check retail me, not for coupons. Okay, these are adorable. I love them. They are by Lucky, and you know I love Leopard. If you follow me on Pinterest, uh, you know I'm all about the animal print, but they're ballerina flats, and I have big feet. Not gonna lie, I do. I, ha I wear 11 wide like that's pretty hard to find in women's size so 11 wide for me fits perfectly with these and I have like the second toe that's longer than the first toe so their cloth ones for me work the best I have two of their leathers I have a black pair and a blue pair and you'll actually be seeing them soon because I have an idea but anyways I have worn these I actually have these in leopard right now and I have worn them so they are so filthy um, but I actually wanted to get another pair so I could rotate them out. They're made really well. Like, they, I'm on my feet a lot at work. And these have held up really well for me. They're really squishy on the inside. Like, I don't know if you could see that dent that I'm getting when I'm pushing on. But you could easily put inserts in. If you get these in leather, they stretch out really well. If you do the freezer ice pack trick, if you don't know what I'm talking about, let me know. And I'll totally fill you in on that next time I do it. Maybe I'll make a tutorial. But so I got another pair of these. And like I said... 11 wide is hard to come by, let alone cute, and these are comfy, and I want to say they were on sale, and I, 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 I have reason to believe they might be discontinuing them, but they're like 40 bucks, which is not the worst, but if you wear size 11 wide, um, good shoes are hard to come by, so $40 is well worth it. So this is, I have these in black leather, blue leather, and leopard, and I, and like, this is a cloth, but it's still adorable. Um... These are aerosols, and I know you're like, oh my god, old lady shoes. Um, they totally aren't. I have these in black, and I have worn them to death. And I know I just got done saying that I wear size 11 wide, and I do, but these shoes run a little longer than normal, or maybe it's because they're open toe. But I have them in black in 11 and, or 10 and a half wide and my toes still just barely come to the edge. So if you're going to order these, just keep that in mind. And it obviously if you order them on Macy's, Macy's is amazing about the returns. I highly recommend it. Um, free shipping on $100 usually, which if you get two pairs of shoes, boom, you're done. Um, but these are white and silver, just something different for summer. But I really, I wore the crap out of these last summer in black and... I probably should have ordered them again in black, but uh, I didn't. So anyways, I'm really looking forward to wearing these because here in Florida, it's been in the upper to mid 80s since I think February. So it's getting hot out. Okay, now this is the one that I'm really excited about opening. I haven't even opened it yet, so I hope it's okay. This is another one of my eBay addictions and it's partially an addiction, but I'll be honest, you guys had a little bit to blame if it is what I think it is. So if you remember, I got married in 2013 and I made a brooch bouquet and apparently you guys on YouTube loved it. It's got like thousands of views and I just kind of went with an overview of how I made it and I keep still like, no matter me walking through it, like verbally saying how I assemble things, people really want like a visual step-by-step. -step. 
So I'm starting to order the supplies for them uh, to make another one, like a demo. And I think this is gonna be a huge part of them for that demo I'm doing. And I got these on eBay and I ordered them they, probably about a month ago. So it did take some time to get here, but for the price, you know, really can't go wrong. Okay, let's see what we got here. Okay, how awesome is that? Oh, yeah, they leave a little nice note saying, give us good reviews. Um, but I ordered six of the same. Whoops. Maybe I ordered more. I think it was this six. Yep, because I really like, I really like these. I really like the, the pattern, and they were a good price if you got them in bulk. So these are going to be a huge portion of my bouquet tutorial that I show soon. I actually have the ball that I'm going to be using, the styrofoam ball I think I'm going to be using. I think I'm going to be using this one. I'm not sure if it's going to be too big or not. We'll see. Um, yeah, it's hard to tell. But anyways, this is the, the base of it. Hopefully it'll work out. But yeah, so I got lots of pins this week. Very cool, very exciting. And shoes. I love shoes. Um, <laughs> let me know if you have shoe problems like me. I don't have a problem, but I just really like good shoes. And that's kind of hard to find in my size. So if you have bigger feet, tell me where you like to go. I'm not about paying for shipping, no, not to be rude, but I don't have that kind of money. So let me know your shoe favorite stores, like the sh your shoe favorites. Where do you go to get your favorite pairs of shoes? I'd love to know. And uh, yeah, did you get anything cool this week? Any sparkly finds? Or they don't have to be sparkly. They could just be pretty flowers. Uh, tell me about it. I love hearing about what you guys got. Let me know in the comments down below. And as always, thank you guys for watching. Let me know what you think of this series. I know it's a little new and it's a little different, but if you like seeing my hauls and my kind of like, this is what's on my nails like right now, weekly sparkly Saturday videos, let me know. I enjoy making them. It seems like you guys enjoy watching them, so. Let me know what you want to see in the future. I'd, uh, I'd be happy to share with you guys. Okay, enough talking. I'm going to go play with all my sparkly good stuff. Uh, have a good week. Enjoy your weekend. See you all next week, hopefully. Bye now.